Hi, good evening. It's Lydia Crafts. I'm a candidate for House District 90. We have a primary coming up June 9th. So as you can imagine, things have continued to change and shift as we face the coronavirus. Uh, we've all had to put our lives on hold and for a lot of this, this has created a dramatic change. Um, so in comparison, small stuff, but our campaign has gone to phones and digital media. As you imagine, I am not out knocking on doors. Um, and so I'm getting a chance to talk to a lot of folks. It's been an exciting week. I'm really happy uh, to hear about a lot of great work being done in the community. And I'm also really appreciating how authentic and candid folks are on the phone about the reality of facing unemployment, the backlog of unemployment claims right now, um, and the stress that it's causing for everyone, regardless of your circumstance. I also want to share my unending appreciation for the healthcare workers, folks in the service industry who are still essential workers, um, putting themselves at risk every day and really making a difference in our community. So thank you. I want to offer a couple of ideas because people have been asking what they can do to help. Um, social distancing is still really important and so a lot of folks are home but they want to do something and in my phone calls I've heard about some great work happening. First there's the Lincoln County Food Initiative which is a collaborative effort. I know that uh, Ricky and Rosie from Fernalds, that Jane Gravel from Main Street Grocery, Kiev Wavis, Lincoln Academy, the Food Pantry, they've all come together to prepare and deliver free meals to anyone in need. So that is the first thing. They are looking for donations. You can donate at the newcastlefoodpantry.org. All of the funding is coming from individual donors right now. Um, and they have a phone number. If you are in need, you can call 563-6658 and they will, they have a answering service or a hotline and they will call you back and make sure you get connected with food or other services you need. So that's the first thing. The second is Chloe Maxman's phone bank. Uh, she has the opportunity for folks to volunteer by making phone calls to people in our area over the age of 60. They're connecting folks with food, medication, essential services, transportation, healthcare needs. Um, Chloe Maximin is a current representative in District 88, if you don't already know her. She's done great work in the legislature and now she's running for Maine Senate in District 13, which encompasses House District 90. So uh, go to her website. I will also include the Google Forms link. The cool thing about the form is it's an opportunity to sign up to volunteer and it's simultaneously a form that you can sign up to request support. So if you, your neighbors, your loved ones are isolated, unable to get access to food or medication, please make sure you uh, go to the Google Form and someone will reach out to you. So those are two really awesome things to know about. And the third is unemployment. Um, you know, it's not my field of expertise, but I just want folks to know that there's a change at the Department of Labor. There's been a huge backlog. I know in the United States right now, something like 9 million people in the last two weeks have claimed unemployment benefits. Um, so it's overwhelming. The main DOL has over 100 employees who are answering calls, but they're not able to keep up. And so they have created an alphabetical system starting on Monday. Um, so make sure I'll also include a link there and on my Facebook site, um, you call based on the letter of your last name. And so it will be Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday with follow-up calls available on Thursday and Friday. So I wanna make sure that everyone has what they need to be able to afford their housing, uh, food, basic medical care, and to stay healthy and well. So please follow along. Um, I'm going to have a Facebook Live event coming up shortly. You can check out my website at lydiacrafts.com, email or text. Um, you can call 593-2664. Uh, if you have any questions, concerns, things you want to talk about, issues that are big right now for you and your family, please go ahead and put them out there. Share in the comments. Um, and I look forward to having some more conversations soon. Thanks so much and have a safe and healthy night. Bye.